first ever champion with a rat tail. Is, have you done the statistical and research you need to do to, to make sure that that is true? I don't think I need to. I'm pretty sure it's true. If it's not, who cares? Well, I know earlier this season you was hating on my braid, so your braids are just okay. Okay, I'll take that. <laughs> this season, um, you proved a lot of people maybe wrong, some people maybe who thought that was all that JaVale had. How were you able to blossom and spread your wings with the Warriors? Why was that possible? I mean, it's just hard work. That's what it really is. Um, the Warriors took me in and, and accepted me for who I am, and I came in with a, with a great mindset of uh, just work as hard as I can as possible and whatever happens 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 and uh, it was just all positivity from there and uh, we definitely made it happen and I'm just glad I got to be a part of the process of being on this team and winning the championship you know you talk about positivity you were a big influx of that guys talk about your humor and how you bring fun to the team um, is there something about the Warriors where that was more brought out than in than in past moments or is this just the culture no I've always been like that it's just the culture of the team uh, they don't take it as a negative most most teams will take it as a distraction I mean if you're losing they try to nitpick at anything so when you win it's a totally different story and uh, I'm just glad I got to be a part of this organization where they could accept me for who I am and you had some great moments running the floor you know getting dunks lobs but a big piece you'll always say is you've got four superstars, four all-stars who are willing to pass the ball and find you. What a luxury that guys are unselfish. Man, some of the most unselfish guys I've ever played with, and uh, all of them are all-stars. That's amazing. So you really got to put that into perspective, uh, just just how how dedicated to team to being a team these guys are, and as a whole, everybody was just ready, and we, we were we were ready to, to do it together. And I feel like we got it done. And I know you're going to have a chance to celebrate the season and also involve the community. You have a charity celebrity uh, softball game coming up on Saturday, the 24th. Saturday, June 24th. Uh, tickets at JugLifeWater.com. Um, half the team's going to be there. Some other celebrities are going to be there. Roz is going to be there. So it should be a, a pretty good. What is the proceeds benefit? Uh, so Jug Life is a, my foundation. We build water wells in Uganda for the less fortunate. And uh, that's what we do. And we also uh, promote uh, a healthy and active lifestyle through drinking water. So it's, a, 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 it's definitely just a healthy, you know what I'm saying, alternative to what other people are doing. What position are you on the softball field? Uh, first base. Long arms. Long arms. My, my catch radius is crazy. I, I bet, I bet. Well, enjoy the parade and uh, all the best in the charity game. I, I hope you guys raise a lot and a lot of awareness too. Thank you. Thank you.